Right, it's time for a, um, a pretty special unpacking video. Um, I always like to think that most of my, um, or most of the Xbox 360 shmup unpacking videos that I've done are quite special. Um, special on new releases. This is a new release for the Xbox 360 uh, by Cave, so it makes it even more special in some ways. And this is the I dare say hotly anticipated uh, Mushi Himasama uh, conversion for the for the Xbox 360. Now it's not uh, multi-region unfortunately so you need to have a Japanese uh, Xbox 360 to play this game. Um, <coughs> excuse me. It was delivered today, it came out, I think it came out, it was either last Friday or this Monday or Tuesday. Can't remember which one but it is a brand new release, so we will get stuck straight into the unpacking and see what we have in the package. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, I ordered this game as most of my new releases from uh, Video Game Imports in the UK. And as I say, it arrived uh, this morning at work actually. Ooh, I'm quite excited about this one, I'll, I'll explain why in a second. That's the front cover. And we have the rear of the cover. Uh, this is the standard edition by the way, it's not the limited edition. I don't really do limited editions. Um, I'm not that much of a collector, I just want the game, to be fair. Uh, the reason why I'm quite excited about this because, in my opinion, and this is for me personally, this is probably the, the best um, yeah, but yeah, I personally feel this is probably the best cave uh, vertical shooter. I absolutely love this game on the PlayStation 2. It is, it is just great. I, I just love it. I love the, I love the style of the game. I love the way that it's quite easy, quite straightforward to get into. I love the music. Uh, so the fact they've actually bought this out now for the 360 is. is uh, is unreal and uh, looking at the forums as regards to what people have said that have actually got this game and had it delivered this week and are playing it everyone that's got it just says it's just awesome it is absolutely outstanding um, I've got a bit of a gut feeling it's probably one of the best conversions that they've done but you know, I could be wrong there I could be getting a bit overexcited but I just can't wait to get this on me uh, Xbox 360 um, now, can I open that? Um, this is uh, called uh, Mushi Himasama HD. So it being no great surprise to appreciate or to know that the uh, graphic style of the game has been changed slightly from the original uh, version of the game. Um, it's been high resed up somewhat, um, which. I suppose really is a bit of a shame. I would have rather have had an arcade mode where the graphics were, uh, the graphic style was unchanged. I don't believe there is such a mode on this, uh, which, like I said, a bit of a shame. So there's the inside of the package. So apart from the disc, obviously, we have a manual and there is a download uh, content card, which is that there. I think this gives you, yeah, this gives you version 1.5. I don't know enough about the the version, uh, the arcade version, to know what the difference is on the 1.5 between version, presumably version one, which is what the disc version will be. But that's download content, and you've got the manual. And again, it makes a change. It's all nice and colour laden. There's quite a bit of stuff in there actually. First off, you've got a bit about the characters. And then there's a bit more about the game modes. Various game modes with screens and sort of screenshots of what uh, different types of game modes are. I have actually done a video of, of this as regards to the, um, 
uh, the PlayStation 2 version, which I absolutely love, I really do. I, I don't spend anywhere near as much time as what it deserves, in my opinion, on that game. I just don't get time really to play games full stop. But but I just absolutely love that game on the PlayStation 2. This is supposed to be better. So, uh, yeah, I'm pretty looking forward to this. Uh, Mushingham Summer is the first of the series of the of the Mushy Himasama series. Um, uh, there's Mushy Himasama and and then there was Mushy Himasama uh, Fatari, you know, Fatari Black Label. Um, those games are already out on the Xbox 360. I've already done some gameplay and unpacking videos on those games or on that version or those versions of the game. So um, yeah. I'm going to get straight down to get some gameplay video of this and I'll tag that on the end of this video. I hope you enjoy the video guys and I'll speak to you again soon. Uh, just before we start the actual uh, sort of run through, a uh, brief run through the gameplay, uh, just to let you guys know, uh, I suspect most of you know this already, but the 1.5 download content for this game, uh, what you actually get with the first release game, is a version that was released in the arcade actually, of uh, Mushi Himasama called uh, Mushihima-sama uh, Masuri and it was released in, in in 2011 I think, last year and it's a slightly different version of the original uh, Mushihima-sama I haven't downloaded that that actual version of the game, the 1.5 game uh, the 1.5 version sorry, of the game, but I will do but this video is just about the normal uh, version so I'll probably do another version later um, I've done a bit of prattling around as regards to just recording some some um, a gameplay as regards to a bit of a um, uh, whatever you call it uh, when you store something sorry when you store a gameplay run so uh, the first part of it is pretty mashed to be honest but it at least gives you a bit of an insight so we'll start that off so this is something that's been saved previously or I've already saved Uh, so you've got three different uh, mode selects. Uh, this is, by the way, this is the Xbox 360 version as regards to the mode, the, the basic mode of it. And this is the closest. Uh, this is basically the arcade version of uh, Mishihumasami. Mishihumasami? Mushihimasami. Christ. I'm not pissed, honestly. Um, uh, this is basically the arcade version, but with HD graphics. Uh, there are three three modes of gameplay there's this there's the range mode and also i think it's called basic mode or something can't remember now but ba I, I i basically just got mashed up there um so uh, this isn't going to particularly show you anything at this point but i'll do continue this is on my naomi cabinet so it has been fired straight into a crt and it is in vga mode but i've actually got the uh, slg 3000 uh, linked into this. Uh, you won't be able to tell that by the uh, video camera um, uh, results that you'll see now on YouTube, but it's it's basically looking like a low res mode even though it is a HD version. Uh, the graphics are absolutely stunning. Uh, they really are. Uh, the music, uh, hopefully you can hear that. I, I, I love this soundtrack to the game. And I just love the game. I just think it, it it plays really, really well, and, and um, I love the graphic style of this game. Got some great bullet patterns on there. And like I said, this is one of my favourite uh, case shooters, uh, personally. Uh, you've got three basic shots, or three versions of shots. Uh, you've got your continuous uh, sort of fast fire. You've got another shot which isn't as quick and you can't move as quickly, your, your ship can't move as quickly but you'll uh, perform more damage and you've got your bomb as well. But these are the classic sort of cave style uh, bullet patterns. And like I said, I, 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 it just plays so well, it really does. I can't... I, I, can't get over the fact of how well this game plays, in my opinion. You 
you know, if you were teetering on the edge of getting the Japanese version of the Xbox 360, <laughs> you know, this this has got to be a bloody good reason to get a Jap Xbox 360. Now you get power-ups as you go through the game to increase your shot and you get something called Trace, you can pick up Traces which are additional tiny little ships that will help you uh, to increase your um, uh, shot power and you've got crystals you need to collect as you go through to, uh, to build up your points I actually find this game really easy to get into as well. It, it's I don't know why I find this easier to get into than some of the other cage shooters, but I don't know why I sound pretty sad and perhaps I'm going to have the same thing over and over again, but I could just keep looking at this game all day. I, I, I just think it looks absolutely gorgeous. weird actually because a lot of people slagged off the PlayStation 2 version um, I actually like it I really do like it I've got a patched version that's actually in 240p graphics mode and that's one of that was one of the issues with the original PlayStation 2 version it was running in 480i so it wasn't particularly nice to look at but once it's patched um, it looks great you know but obviously you don't get that problem with this version and I think possibly that's it for this quick uh, gameplay video but um, but hopefully that will give you an insight to what the game looks like and I would absolutely wholeheartedly recommend this game if you're an Xbox 360 owner and you've got a Japanese Xbox 360 if not go and buy one because because <laughs> this game just seriously rocks <laughs>